<laughs> Say hello to everyone. Say it's early on Sunday morning. And I woke up with a fever. You got you got fever? Yeah. What are you eating? A ducky. You have a ducky. Yeah, you have a ducky. You're eating pancake and apple? Yeah. And some juice? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, is he going to eat your food? No, eat your food. He is. Hello, everyone. Good morning. So, it is super duper early. Well, it's early for us. It's like 7 o'clock on Sunday. And, um, Miss Maddie Bear started running a fever in the middle of the night. I kept noticing as I was uh, laying beside her that she was getting hotter and hotter throughout the night and so we got up early she woke up kind of early I'm assuming because of the fever and we came downstairs and checked her temp and it was 101 so she has a little fever but she she doesn't like I asked her this morning are you sick she goes no I'm not and she I took her temperature but she started crying because she didn't want me to take it so she will not tell me when she's feeling bad at all because she doesn't want to be sick. <laughs> she doesn't like the doctor or anything like that. Pluto. So we're watching some YouTube toy genie. We are watching her open up lots of Mickey Mouse character pets. Let's see if we can zoom in. Here they are. Is that fun to watch, Maddie? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, hi. Mm-hmm. Oh, see. Do milk? Yeah, there's the remote. Can you finish your apples? Yeah. Yeah? Good girl. I hear a ball. You hear a ball? I hear a ball. You hear Maxie's ball. Mm -hmm. Yep, Max playing with his ball somewhere, isn't he? So we're just hanging out, and uh, last night I had all of this stuff over here. I was working on my planner. So I have all of my washi tape in here, and my planner bag, and my life planner. Next week we're doing a monkey, I'm doing a monkey thing. Let's see if I can show you guys. All right, here's my monkey theme. I did yellow and green for like bananas. And this is what this week ended up looking like. Look at all this writing. Busy week. I had lots to do. So, did you just burpee? Mm -hmm. Say excuse me. Say excuse me. Thank you. So here is Sunday. Mama. What? Pumpkin. What? A pumpkin. Oh, a pumpkin down there? So. There will be lots for me to do today, I'm sure. Um, first on my list, since I didn't get to it yesterday, is my CC planning. So, I have to definitely do that first thing this morning. This has been on my list, I think, every day this week to clean out the fridge. We're supposed to look at a house today, so I, was, um, I did do that, I just didn't check it off that so I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my tutor planning and get that out of the way this morning so that I feel like I don't have to worry about that at all so um, here we go this is my tutor planning Hello. notebook I'll oh, see yeah um, this is my tutor planning notebook this is the greatest binder ever I have it labeled here tutor planning these are the Staples binders, oh, best nice. binders ever. So I've so showed you guys my notebook for tutor planning before, but I'll give you a quick run through again. Cycle one at a glance. Oh, Maddie's crawling up into my lap. Okay, sit right there, okay? Are you cozy now? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> so here's cycle one at a glance. It gives me an idea. We are on week eight, so age of imperialism. Geography is China. 
seed plants. It's our science. For math, we're doing 14s. Latin is third declension. English grammar is of throughout. Uh, timeline is card number 50 through 56. Uh, music symbols and names is what our fine arts is and then the owl pellet dissection is our hands-on science so that will be super fun all right so here is my first tab it says calendar schedule I made these dividers myself just with some cardstock some um, decorative a uh, scrapbook paper and then just lamination and so I love these dividers they work really well um, let's see October week eight okay um, so here are my weekly notes and I do keep this little zipper pocket here just in case I have anything loose that I want to contain there so each week I have the planner strip for the memory work and it gives me all the memory work at a glance here, which I really like. So then um, for each week I have this sheet and it has a section for each category. And for history, I have printed off all of the hand motions and glued them onto this sheet. So we always do the so a song and um, the history song and hand motions for history. That is always going to be the same. Geography is pretty much the same. Um, we usually do just locating the areas on our map. And sometimes we do like Cheerios or candy and we put those on the different places. Um, English, I always try to do a song and um, maybe different voices or something like that. Latin, there is a song that CC has for Latin and sometimes I'll have like words that they can step on around the room or something like that to help them commit that to memory. Math always has a memory song so we use the song from and I have the app on my phone and sometimes I'll let them um, help me by using a pointer at the board or we erase a number or two and see if they can guess which ones are missing. And then science, um, song typically with hand motions or something like that. Um, you can put words on Duplo blocks. That's something that I did for one week. And then fine arts. This will be different for this week, but this week we're doing tin whistle stuff. So, and then this week was some art that I had from different printouts. So each week I just have what I'm going to be using um divided into that week so we are way back here we are on week eight these are all some things that we've already done let's see that's week seven and we are on week eight so i have some basic lesson planning already done here um, so I just go through and um, add some specifics so I also um, go through the hand motions and practice those and make sure that I know them and practice it with the song so that I can teach the kids looks like Maddie's been drawing on my paper um, hello hi <laughs> I'm going to get on CC Connected. I'm going to look up some songs. I'm going to practice the history hand motions and um, read the lesson for Tin Whistle. Make sure that I'm very familiar with that. Practice a little bit um, and create any printables that we'll need for class. And then that will be it. All right. So I'm going to get busy and then I'll show you guys what I came up with. Okay. You want to say hello? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Maddie's videotaping. <laughs> Are you showing everybody my planner? Yeah. Dolphin. Yeah. What?
you ready for a quesadilla? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Are we talk to Rita's again? Hey, Mom. What? Tell her where this went. Oh, yeah, I will. Just a second. Let me order your food. So, we have been out looking at some uh, houses. Actually, we looked at one house. And we stopped in here at Sauceritas for some lunch. And we are getting ready to go look at one more house today. Come on, Maddie. Come on. You got your drink? A lot. You want to walk? Well, let's make sure there's no traffic. Come on. Come on. Hey, guys. So, I have done almost no vlogging today. Um has not been a good day. It's been a really bad day actually. Kind of a washout. Um, Maddie's been super duper sick. She's been running a high fever. Um, you know, we were out looking at houses and um, that really, get down cat, really didn't go very well. Um, the homes were just not right and um, with Maddie being sick it was a bad idea anyway. And then Jimmy and I got into an argument and that was followed by lots of tears and it was just a crappy day. Excuse my language. So, um, please get down. No, get down. Oh, cat won't stay off the table. Um, so Maddie's asleep on the couch right now and I'm trying not to wake her up because she's miserable and I look really bad, I know, I'm sorry. I'm actually um, videoing on my phone, so sorry for the horrible quality, but I think my camera is in the um, car, and Jimmy's gone to pick Jacob up. He had his um, little trip to the corn, uh, corn maze with the school group, and then they were having a bonfire afterwards, so he, um, has had a good day and then um, Gavin and Alex went to Carowinds for a few hours and I don't know guys it was just a really cruddy day and I really didn't feel like vlogging I really didn't even feel like talking about it but you know I am um, but anyway we're married we have arguments. We sometimes say hurtful things. Um, you know, we both of us do, and we say it in anger, and it's kind of ridiculous when we do that. And it's not good for either one of us, but I'm sorry, I'm gonna start crying again. It's just been a bad day. <laughs> I know it's gonna be better tomorrow. It always is, and it always feels worse at night, you know? But, have you guys ever had days like this? These days don't come frequently, but when there's a lot of stress, like, you know, in our life, <laughs> I'm trying not to cry, I'm sorry. But when there's a lot of stress in our life, um, it tends to create some more arguments than normally. And we have some stressful things going on right now, so. Um, anyway, I just wanted to check in with you guys, and I'm making some tea, and I'm going to try and drink some herbal tea and kind of chill out. Because when I start crying, like, I can't stop. I cry all day. Is that completely ridiculous? Like, I just, everything makes me cry. Like, when I get started, everything makes me cry. So, we're okay now, but my feelings are still kind of raw, you know? Oh. So anyway, I'm going to try not to end this vlog on a really bad note, so I'm going to try to vlog a little bit more, but I'm just really bummed out that Maddie's sick. I'm worried that I won't be able to tutor on Tuesday again. Um, I don't know. 
I'm just worried about a lot of stuff, so. <laughs> anyway, um, my kitchen's a mess. I made some quick food for the kids tonight. We had some sandwich and hot dogs. Well, they did. I didn't really eat anything. Because when I'm upset, I don't eat. <laughs> so, um, I'm gonna... I can't really clean the kitchen because Maddie is asleep on the couch and I'm afraid that any noise will wake her up. So, I'm just gonna let it be and I'm gonna go sit down and drink some tea and try to like regroup a little bit <sighs> because I feel so down. Don't you guys hate days like this? Oh my gosh. Like as if there isn't enough stress in the world. You know, you have to go and have an argument with your spouse. <laughs> and when you have an argument with your spouse, it feels like the world is coming to an end. And I don't know why. I think it's because we care so much about them, you know. So, all right, what kind of tea am I gonna have? I'm kind of out of the teas that I really, like I love chamomile tea at night, and I am out of all of my chamomile tea, I think. Yep. I don't want green tea. I, I have this tea right here and I really don't like it. I don't know if you guys can see what this is or if it's backwards because I'm using the camera this way, but it's vanilla coconut. Okay, it's starting to whistle. So I'm going to take this off before it wakes her up. And probably I have a little bit of my African nectar rooibos tea. So I'm going to go ahead and make some of that. So I'll see you guys in just a little bit. I'll try to end out the vlog on a happy note tonight for you guys.